Well, hello everybody. Day 36 of my carnivore diet adventure. Big news today is I had a little bit of a stumble. Um, not the worst that it could have been. Uh, I didn't go out and eat any bread or anything, but I did have, I did go to KFC um, and I had some chicken. So I had a chicken breast and a drumstick. So it could have been worse, but strictly definitely not on the diet. Um, again, I think I've said this before, but for people who aren't in the UK, <clears throat> It's not the breading like you get in the U.S. The The breading that we have over here is very, very light. So there really wasn't much to it, but there was some delicious chicken skin and loads of fat. So that, I'm hoping, offset it a little bit. But anyway, it is what it is. I had it. I move on. I'll try and do better tomorrow. Um, what else did I have? I had a couple of steaks. So I had nearly 200 grams of steak for dinner. And I had a few macadamia nuts, and I had some eggs. So sort of my normal stuff. Um, weight was the same when I got up this morning. Um, sleep was about the same, so mid-80s. I did get 15,000 steps today, though, so that was really good. I went to the gym um, for the third day in a row, which is really good. I did another hour of cardio, and I... Oh, uh, yeah... I got some new shoes. So I had some running shoes. For those of you who've been following along, you know that my, my running shoes got stolen from my locker at the gym. And I've been without for a few days, but I finally stumped up and went to the store, got some new ones. Um, I got some Brooks. Maybe I'll put a picture in for you so you can see them. I think they're the, I can't remember what they're called, but anyway. The best thing is, is that since my knee's been feeling a little bit better, what I thought I would do is just try and run. So yesterday I ran for like five minutes or something, or I ran for a minute. I can't remember, but I ran, I ran just a little bit just to sort of see and test out the knee. Um, I think the other day I did one minute and then yesterday I did five minutes. And then today I ran for 20 minutes. So at the start of my run, so just got stuck in and ran for 20 minutes and then slowed down a little bit. Um, I was just starting to get a little bit sore. So I thought, okay, I'm not going to push it. And I've got to break my new shoes in as well. So they were a little bit uncomfortable on my feet, but that'll go away. That's, I always have that with new shoes. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice is terrible again. So I was well pleased that I was able to run 20 minutes and with no pain. Slowed down, walked the last 10 minutes, then did another half an hour on the bike. <clears throat> Again, I'm not I'm not having any pain really in the knee, um, but I am just trying to take it easy. And I also, when I was running, I wasn't running super fast. I was only running slightly faster than walking pace. But again, I wanted to try out the new shoes. I wanted to try out the knee and all was good. So I'm pretty pumped about that. Really, really excited. I'm in Cambridge tomorrow. <clears throat> all day so I've got to get up super early in the morning and then take the train which is about an hour and a half so I'm gonna have to stop at some point along the way and I'm gonna need to pick up some stuff because the place the look I know the location where I'm gonna be and I'm not sure that they're gonna have anything that will work on the diet so I'm pretty much gonna have to take everything with me and I don't I don't really have anything at the house it's going to work. So I just need to stop by the grocery store. There is one on the way um, at one of the stations. So I can just pop in to one of the stations and get some food. So I should be okay on the diet for tomorrow, but we'll see. Maybe a little bit of extra coffee or something. But other than that, I should be all right. And yeah, so I had my electrolytes again today. I think my weight has sort of leveled out meaning the water weight, not my fat weight, just the water weight from having the electrolytes and doing the exercise. So I pretty much expect the weight to kind of stay the same tomorrow. We're at 95.9. And yeah, we'll we'll see what happens. I probably won't have any electrolytes tomorrow because I won't go to the gym or anything. I'll have a day off because I'm going to be quite busy going around. And then we'll get back on it on Wednesday. So yeah, a little disappointed that I had some KFC today, but I just couldn't, 
I just couldn't face bacon and eggs for lunch again or, or something or just some, you know, roasted chicken or whatever. So I did the best I could. But there we go. We persevere. We just move on. There's nothing I can do. Is there any comment about that? I did feel a bit bloated, but I don't know if that was just psychosomatic that I knew that I'd eaten some wheat that I wasn't supposed to eat. So maybe I just felt a little bit more bloated because I did drink, I drank half a liter of water while I was eating, and then I drank my electrolytes after that. So it could have just been because I had tons and tons of water in my stomach as well. So, but I went to the gym, I felt fine. I felt a little queasy after the gym, but by the time I came home and I had some, I had a little bit of um, cheese as well, so some cheddar cheese and my steaks, and then I felt better after that and I felt fine. So I don't think there's any problem. Anyway, um, that's all for tonight. I will see you guys tomorrow, and hopefully I'll have better results to report by then. But anyway, if you're out there, if you're on the diet, stick with it. If you're just starting the diet, I see there's lots of people in the comments who it looks like are also starting their carnivore adventure as well. There's a couple of people that actually started in January at the same time I did. So if you're one of those people, please hit the subscribe button if you haven't already and let it let me know and if you're doing anything publicly then i'll be happy to subscribe back and to and to check in and see how you're doing and if not just go ahead and leave comments and let let me know how you're getting on and um let me know if you stumble or if you have trouble and we can try and just get through it together anyway everybody have a good night we'll see you tomorrow bye, -bye.